What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another highlight video. Long overdue. Uh, there was a change in the editor. Well, there was no editor. Um, I got lazy. Poker was pretty rough for a couple months, so I just wasn't having a lot of runs. Um, anyway, excuses, excuses. But I have a backlog of about 11 videos that I have just uploaded that are ready to be made into highlight videos, and uh, I've been grinding a lot of poker. So the next few months should be pretty good on the channel. Also, during May... I'm thinking about bringing back the vlog series, which was somewhat popular last year, kind of a day in the life, more uh, uh, kind of lifestyle version, uh, poker videos on top of the highlights. So I think the next few months should be pretty nice in the channel and hopefully we get some nice runs. As for this one, $500 day two event in the money, uh, pretty exciting stuff. So enjoy this highlight video. Nice to be back and I'll see you in the next one. Might get the play a hand here. Yep. Raise it up. That one starts in an hour and 45 minutes. I'm gonna go small on the flop here. Think of her check raise, not very large either, which I'm happy about. Turn a straight, does bring in the club. I don't know if we can judge by the sizing a lot about clubs or no clubs. I think just call here. Could be missing a raise, but I think call makes more sense to me. I mean, it's a good run out, but not, it's like also sometimes a bad run out, you know? Hmm. It's actually a pretty sick spot because we lose to the flush, lose to queen jack. I guess they could have some like jack 10 for value. Could still be bluffing, could have a worse straight. I don't know if we can fold, but it's not even that high up in my range anymore. Good luck. Nice. Nice freaking pot. Let's go. Like I have boats, flushes. Uh, a lot of those big flushes are kind of gone from my range. So I guess I don't have as many flushes. So yeah, it is it is pretty high up. Pretty high up. Pocket eights. It's actually probably not too bad to shove here. 20 blinds, 27. I mean, it's a little bit much against these stacks. This player is super wide. Um, okay, I'm going to play call. All right, go heads up. That's pretty good, actually. Come on, big pot, 15 in the middle. 15 in the middle, come on. Keep our stack nice. That looks good to me. Nice. It's an interesting pre-flop spot. Like, shove makes some sense, call makes some sense, click makes some sense to me. Let's go, back to back eights. 50 out of 375 left. Looking pretty good. Sending the run good. Gonna call versus check raise. Deuce is not always harmless. Sometimes bottom pair gets into the check raise range. That's not always harmless. I think we can account on the flop like to sometimes be ahead of some like bottom pair or second pairs. Turn, I think check or small bet are both, they both accomplish something, but I'll go small. River eight. I mean, I prefer if there was no river, but yeah, that's better. Take it down. Pocket tens late position. Good luck. Pocket tens. It's a six. That is a good spot. Can we hold, though? Yep. Boom! Let's go, man. Day two is so clean so far. Awesome. Defend here against Bill. I don't know if we should, like, only call with ace highs here, or just also, like, this one. Check back. Small bet. I guess like there could be some king x on a king 7-7, seven, seven. but then small bet. I mean, I guess my range is just dead. Why not small bet? Just debating a lead, but... <sighs> I just have a king? I feel like I gotta find out now after hitting a jack. It's a weird line. I mean, obviously they get counterfeit with some stuff on the turn, but... It's weird, right? Because they can just play range bed, so I don't know. It's better not be ace-jack. That'd be sick. Nice! Let's fucking go, dude. 
Glad I found that call in the turn. They have like 10 nines and stuff in their range. Makes it a lot better. Oh, the final table is actually on Tuesday. So there would be a break if we made the final table. Queen 3 0, just limp. I'll keep my weakest queen in a double check. Seems reasonable. Could also just go bet bet, but. River Jack, definitely want to bet now. I think call is these. We're gonna call up here. King low. If today ends up being a loss, that's still a good thing. How do you how do you mean? You lost me a little bit there. All right, no overbets, bro. Keep it chill. No overbets. No need for it. All right, Vladimir. Nice. Let's fucking go, dude. Oh, my hand had some good properties here on the river. I mean, unblocking all the queen, the jack, the nine, the eight, blocking five, four, which I mean, I think is relevant against their stack depth. They probably play it. Oof. This is a bad hand for the delay. Honestly, 14 in the middle, 21 behind this board texture. I'm just gonna go all in. Actually helps my delay situation a little bit. I think Jam's pretty good out of position here. Good luck, bottom set. That's fine. Is it the three of diamonds? Hey, we got quads, baby. Oh my god, what a day. Let's go. It's even the right diamond. What a day. Playable, usually. Do we want to check raise? There's no option. So we don't pick up any equity. I'm just checking with this hand. Any five, any nine, any ten, any diamonds, any four, jack ten. I, there's, I mean, we could rain. We could bet everything in our range, but... I think this one's just gonna check fold. Defend the big blind here against Alex. I'm gonna check call here with the ace jack. Turn is the ace. Sometimes maybe good, sometimes maybe sheet. Our hand is worth a lot here. Everything bricks. Everything bricks. Play flat here for 38. I was thinking like one or 1 1.5. We probably want to call one. I'll let her go. Just one time. Is this a 14 big blind reshove? Give him the ace queen. Give him the ace queen. It's only gross if Vladimir isos. Although when they cover me, they probably have to take ace queen as well, because this should be some ace jack and queen. Here we go, guys. What a sweat. Final 116. Alright, they do have the pair. Big flip. Well, I've ran pretty pure to get here. I ran pretty pure to get here. That I mean this is this is, that was the most important part of the day, probably, but. Well, maybe not. We still have 20 blinds. It's okay. And we get sevens here. Good spot. Don't mind the shove. We welcome a shove. Still welcome a shove. All right. It's another flip. Good. Nah. It's an okay start. Okay turn. God. Green is good. All right, we lose back-to-back -back flips in the final 115. Not ideal. Back-to-back -back flips in the final 115. I mean, it's it's not really the time to lose the pots, right? Can't say we've ran bad today, but... Uh, 
Definitely not the time in the tournament to start to run bad. Luckily, I'm still in. Still in, 12 bigs. Bit of a buzzkill. A6, if it folds to us, we can uh, participate. It might. It might fold to us. We'll take the shove. All right, good luck. Don't think raise fold is going to be better than shove here for nine and a half. It's worth considering, but I'm going to go for the shove. The more, like, the worse or more passive the big blind is as well, the better non in might be. Get called. Queen 10. Okay. Another flip. Be a great time for a jack. Be a really good time for a jack. <laughs> back to back to back all ins. And we get 107th. Fuck, that was really that was a really good run. Uh, I think I just I, yeah, I feel like I played that really well. Oh man. Big score has not arrived yet. The break-even grind continues. GG though, guys. Honestly, like, there's really very few hands that I would play differently today. A lot of stuff went our a lot of a lot of stuff went our way like all day. We had some really good pots. Most of the post-flop spots were like very smooth, which you can't always say. Ran very well until the big money was starting to happen, and we lost three all ins, and we got it in good every time. I was hoping that might be a breakout score though. That was it was getting juicy, man. It's getting juicy.